Hi, this is Hunter. I'm an Applications Engineer here at Hawkridge Systems. And today we're going to look at some of the enhancements and added functionality in the Explode View tool in SOLIDWORKS 2015. So first off, let's create a global Explode View of all these components. And I'm going to use the Auto Space Components on Drag functionality. And you'll notice a couple enhancements here. So first off, as I drag components, notice I'm getting a dynamic preview of what this uh, explode is going to look like, so that just takes the guesswork out of using the auto space. Also, we'll notice as I rearrange these components that these studs actually have been exploded on a similar plane. So, uh, new in 2015, any components that are mated to the same plane are all going to explode in a logical fashion. Now, zooming in on this bearing, let's do another example of an explode and this gives me the opportunity to show a new type of explode step that is new to SOLIDWORKS 2015 and that's the radial explode step. So there's a new button up here in the interface. I'll select the radial explode and I quickly want to grab all of those bearing balls so I'm going to use a brand new selection set. That's a new functionality in 2015 as well. And notice now uh, my explode triad is just a ring that gives me the reference direction and an arrow and as I drag we get the nice radial explode type uh, really great for things like uh, bolts that are oriented along an axis or, or just like this, this ball bearing. So I'm sure you're going to appreciate some of the new functionality in the explode view tool in SOLIDWORKS 2015. Thank you for watching.